So most complex stuff can be abstracted if you get the form and texture anywhere close to right. Leaves, crowds, trees. <laughs> look at look at that tree. It's so naughty. With that in mind, model a city. Big cubes, little cubes, stacked cubes. Select a few edges and bevel them. I'm keeping everything as one object. Create a new material in the shader editor and give it a gray, smooth, glossy material. Create a brick texture and plug it into the displacement. It'll aim straight down, so we gotta rotate it. So add a texture coordinate node and use object. With the eyedropper, select a random cube and rotate it 90 degrees on the x-axis and 45 on z, and then scale it so it looks like windows. Turn off the offset and you're good. You can also mix in a mud's grave texture, just to give the windows a bit of extra warble. Nice. Take a night city picture with lots of clean windows and mix that image texture in with an add shader. Rotate to a diagonal and hit U project from view to project every side at once. In the UV editor, slide the UVs around so you're not getting a bunch of sky in your buildings. Make it look nice. I'm gonna make a cube with a red emit shader. Give the city a hair type particle system with a source type as verts. Have it render as an object, the beacon on every vertex. Oh, I dig it. To make little hazy bits, set an emission shader as the shader's volume so you can sculpt the feel of the city and add depth. And that's it. It's low poly so you can have thousands of... Is this dystopian?